In this video, we'll take a look at the new viewport improvements in Instamat 2025, from ray tracing to improved support for advanced material types. Let's dive in. Instamat 2025 supercharges its real-time 3D viewport with ray trace shadows, global illumination, and reflections. Here, we see a brick material made in the element graph. We can quickly enable ray tracing by clicking on the ray tracing button in the viewport toolbar. Immediately, we can now see the ray trace shadows add an extra level of depth and dimension, giving us an enhanced preview of how this material will look in our scene. Ray trace shadows also improve the asset texturing experience when working with layering and painting workflows. The ray tracing settings can be found in the viewport settings panel and provide control over each individual ray tracing effect. From here, we can enable global illumination and ray traced reflections. Global illumination simulates how light bounces between surfaces, making it easier to see how materials and scenes will look in natural lighting conditions. Ray traced reflections add another level of realism when texturing assets and creating beauty renders. Speaking of beauty renders, let's see how we can create high quality beauty renders right from within Instamat by dialing in the ray tracing render quality. We can control the quality with the render quality dropdown. Setting a lower quality will provide faster previews in the viewport while texturing assets and creating materials. Increase the quality to very high to create beautiful renders of your 3D assets and materials. You can adjust the ray tracing frame count to control how many frames Instamat uses to refine and clean up the final render. To capture an image from the viewport, click the Copy Image to Clipboard button or use the keyboard shortcut Command or Control C. You can then paste the image into your image editor of choice or anywhere that supports image attachments. Creating beauty renders directly within Instamat is a great way to do quick design reviews. You can also use your own custom environment images to maintain consistent lighting and presentation across your assets. When moving the viewport camera or performing actions in Instamat, you'll notice a brief delay before ray tracing effects appear. You can customize this delay in the Preferences panel under the Viewport tab by adjusting the Post-Processing Effects Delay setting. Instamat 2025 introduces enhanced bloom effects and improved emissive rendering. Simply dial in the bloom strength and the emissive intensity to your liking. These effects are perfect for materials like this lava flow material from Instamat's built-in material library. By the way, Instamat comes with a built-in dope sheet and keyframe editor, making it easy to animate any node parameter in the element graph, including the camera position. Use the playback capture feature to create cinematic animated videos with ray tracing effects included, from turntables to dynamic animated effects. You can also set the capture source to the image viewer. Instamat's viewport now supports materials with clear coat, anisotropic, and sheen properties. These advanced properties create more realistic, complex surfaces like car paint, brushed metals, and fabrics. The new transmission support also enhances the visualization of translucent and glassy materials. Thanks for watching this video on the new viewport improvements in Instamat 2025. From ray tracing to improved bloom to additional properties like clear coat, sheen, and transmission, the viewport in Instamat Studio provides a great experience when visualizing your materials and texturing your 3D assets. Now, to learn more about what's new in Instamat 2025, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Here we have an ever-expanding library of videos covering the ins and outs of Instamat. 
And be sure to check out our community forum and Discord server, where you can ask questions, share your creations, and engage with members of the Instamat community. Well, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, drop us a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe. For the latest news about Instamat, please visit our website, follow us on X, join us on Discord, or sign up for the Abstract community. You can find all the links in the video description below. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next one.